Thomas the Tank Engine and Friends, Tales from the Rails, Episode 34, Revolutionaries. While the age of steam may be coming to a close around the world, on the island of Sodor, it lives on. Steam engines are make the island special and separate from any other railway. While steam continues to run the island, diesels may think not. Some diesels are resourceful and kind. Meanwhile, some are devious and disrespectful, but meanwhile, one day, Diesel was waiting at the rail crossing when Duck slowly approached and stopped. Isn't it your way, said Diesel? Why come in so sluggish and slow? Not enough puff in the morning? No, said Duck, I have puff. It's just I can pull twice the load today. I'm just coming in slow because you know the rule. Safety first. Safety does apply in this railway. You do know that, right? Of course, said Diesel. I'm being safe as well, but the signal was diverted for me. Well, if you're so new and retro, whatever, revolutionary, said Diesel. Get it right. That's what us diesels are. New and revolutionary. Pa, said Duck. Just you wait and see. Look at the railway. With that, Duck puffed away, quite cross. Diesel then continued on. Yes, he said. Revolutionaries. That's what us diesels are. When Diesel arrived at the yards, he found Daisy and Bowler there. Hello, you two. Look like all the revolutionaries are here. Revolutionaries, said Bowler. Huh, it's sort of got a catch to it. But what's up with this? I know you want to change the island, but I already tried. Jeez, I was sent packing. I'm lucky I got another trial here. So this is a trial, eh? said Diesel. Well, serve it right. Yes, said Daisy. Trials are always good. Well, of course, said Bowler. I, I, I'm working fine, he stuttered. I guess, said Daisy. I'd best be off. This milk is going to turn bad soon. All right, said Diesel. Go revolutionize the dairy business. And Bowler laughed. You're really on this topic, aren't you? Yes, I am, said Diesel. It's time for a change. Later that day, Diesel had to go to the quarry to stock trucks of stone and take them to the docks. When Diesel arrived at the quarry, he gave the trucks a giant bump. Come on, get in the line. I have to take you later today. This upset the trucks, and so they would pay him out. And so when shunting, the trucks started to chant, No, 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 we don't want to go. This big Diesel, he's too slow. Diesel crew crosser still. Diesel soon shunted the trucks in line, but they were comfortable and didn't want to move, so they put on their brakes. Diesel pulled and pulled, but the trucks didn't move. Come on, come on, come on, said Diesel. You're going to make me late. It's a top of that's not going to be cross with me if I'm late again. But their brakes were tight on. Diesel pulled and pulled and pulled, but nothing happened. Soon, he was uncoupled and he gave up. Then the quarry manager asked Toby to pull the train. And soon he was coupled up, but Diesel was still cross. If my revolutionary class cannot pull these trucks, then how can an old steam tram like you pull it? Watch, said Toby. The trucks liked Toby, so they undid their brakes for him, and with ease, Toby started to pull them out of the yards. Not so revolutionary are you, Diesel, said Toby laughing. This is the day an old steam tram beats a revolutionary Diesel. This is the day. This is the day, said Toby laughing. Later that night, Diesel returned to the other engine sheds. And when he arrived, everybody started laughing at him. What's so funny, said Diesel. So what? That a steam dram out beats me today. There'll be no other days. Yeah, said Oliver. But that's why we gave Toad the shed today. Yes, Mr. Diesel, said Toad. I guess now brake fans outclass Diesels too. Diesel grew crosser still. Urgh, how dare you say that? Us Diesels are new and revolutionary and we could crush you steamies any day. Not like today, said Murnock. Even a steam tram beat you. Diesel was fuming. Oh, I can't stand this. And with that, he purred away quite cross. From then on, Diesel learned about Diesel's not being so revolutionary and about steam engines and how they may outclass Diesel's one day.